everyone, my name is Thomas Asula Jr. aka Mustache Jam and welcome back to some more Pokemon Sun or Dawn or whatever mix up I'm doing this day, I don't know. At any rate, uh, last time we came over here, the threat was beyond serious, so I guess I'll just leave. And if another plot thing happens, I guess I'll just go with that, but, um... Anywho, I just came off of the ride of Digimon. I just recorded that, like, earlier today. So, oh, well, it's nighttime. That's different. So, it is... Poke now it's Pokemon Dusk? I mean, no, wait, what's nighttime? D dawn? Ugh. Pokemon Night? I don't know. Oh boy. Anyways, so I just recorded that, talked about uh, Digimon Apple as a show in the, 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 a lot of tamers around here, or whatever they're called, uh, came off of what I was talking about, Digimon Apple, which is a new show, relatively new anyway. Um... I talked about that a bit. Can I talk to you? Pokemon I've got are grass type. Okay. What does that mean? I'm looking for water type Pokemon for my team so I can beat fire types too. Oh, so is that... Okay. Anyway... I guess it's just an advice character. Dum to dum. Let's run a little bit here. I saw another human up there. I still don't know where the um. What am I thinking of? The Pokemon, like a Pokemon Center, like where I can buy items. I swear I don't remember these humans being here before. At least I don't remember all of them. So I think after I'm done doing this session, I'll train my other Pokemon that I do have off screen as I said that a few times and you know just a little bit less convenient to do that on screen as well but I think this might be a primary training session but um yeah I decided that I wanted to give a shout out because um an, in, an individual by the name of Ministry of Darkness 21 gave me like three shout outs on his channel and I'm associated with a group on Facebook with that but um yeah he does like tournament stuff with um I believe it's Smash uh the, the Brawl I don't know which one it is because I'm not as familiar with that series as Pokemon so I don't know which one's which, which, oh, I forgot these guys are weak, uh, blah, I already forgot that these guys, they don't, they don't deal with that fire, they, they, they don't want to get lit, and I remember, I forget what episode it was on this, and I was, like, talking about shipping, um, lit, a lit in with a black Gautamon, so you can have a cross ship. You don't, uh, I don't, I don't know, I don't know if we see enough of those, you know, so that's why I, oh no, that's going to be super effective, right? Ugh. It's super effective. Alright. So, what are today's topics? So, I did talk about that Digimon Apple, and the reason I talked about it there, and I'll talk a little bit about here, uh, that here as well, is because they made a, well, they made that one episode that's very similar to Pokemon Go, uh, in that it's like a, like some sort of app where you like find, um, was it like treasure? Ooh, yeah. All right, so. That was a very dangerous battle. I did not know that the that po Pokemon specifically shut out water. Oh uh, boy. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. I got myself into a messy situation right here. 
Uh, let's see. I wonder, is there items in my bag? I do have potions, so I think... I think that is what I will do, is I will give my Pokemon a potion. Alright, that was... Uh, what I needed and for by the way for the Ministry of Darkness 21 I will leave a link in the description to his channel since that will be the complete version of the shout out is to do that whoop, whoop, whoop. I saw this kid I do want to talk to him first because I don't think I talked to him prior is there F on this street let's just make one way trips Jump over one and you're back. You're there in a flash, but there's no quick way back from that trip. Okay, so just more tips. Dum to dum. I guess I'm going this way. Oh yeah, this is a shortcut to my home. So that means that that uh, buffalo Pokemon is gone, right? over here to my left a street oh it's the plot and I guess the main character's girlfriend I still don't know that but hold on just a moment let me show you the po oh that's what exactly what I was asking about for the past like few episodes anyways let me show you the Pokemon Center first oh dear oh my Thank you. I was like begging, like, please give me an item place. I think that's where you buy items, I would hope so. Right. I'm gonna probably stop. Ooh, fancy. <laughs> so it looks like I want to go to my right, because that looks like potions. Hello, nurse. Uh. Lily. Oh, it's still her talking. If you talk to the woman at the counter, she can restore your Pokemon to perfect health. Will that cost anything? It's amazing, isn't it? I can't stand seeing Pokemon in pain. And who's that lucky little layer over there? You can also deposit Pokemon in the PC here, or take them out. Okay, so I can... Oh, okay. And at the Pokemon Mart, you can buy all kinds of items that should help you during your trials. I'd take a look if I were you. <laughs> That's, you know, almost make it sound like a threat, like, you better, bitch. Over there is the cafe area. I like to relax there sometimes with a frosty glass of Momo milk. Or Moo Moo milk, I'm not sure. I read something in a travel guide about Alola once. Apparently each Pokemon Center in Alola offers a different selection of drinks. I wonder how they pick what they to serve. The cafes may also offer more than just drinks. I've heard also they also sell special treats and that sometimes the staff have tips for trial goers. Oof, that was a tough sentence for whatever reason. Blah. Alright. Thanks for the tour. We should head to the trainer school next. Hey. But have your Pokemon taken care of first if you think that they need a little aid. Don't advance the plot too fast for me, Missy. I'm still trying to figure stuff out here. Alright, let's see what we got. I can't, I still can't read that by the way. It's way too small with text. Welcome to the Pokemon Center. You're up late. Would you like to rest your Pokemon? Is it free? Because I don't see the downside to this. I'll take out your Pokemon for a few seconds. Even though I just like healed my, uh, a da da so looks like um, a screen from D uh, Digimon Masters Online, which is, uh, it's like the stat 
thing a little bit. It reminds me of that, but there's cards involved in that. Anyway, thank you for waiting. We restored your Pokemon to full health. We hope to see you again. Bye bye Alright. So, I imagine the F is the plot. Oh, whoops, you can buy things and sell things at the Pokemon Mart. I feel better with a bag full of panty of potions and Pokeballs. What about you? Show them, but let's talk to you. Let's see what you got. Welcome to Pokemon Mart. May I help you? Let's buy some stuff. Yeah. Alright. Ooh, wee. Paralyze heal awakening. What's awakening? Is that like a oh? How where's oh? I have a lot of money. Okay, I was like, where's my money? So I'll get like ten of those. Nineteen, looking good. You can purchase away your medicine pocket. Alright, let's stock up on everything, at least get like 10 of everything, I think that's a fair assessment, I mean I have a lot of Pokemon, like that's so much to begin with, wow, how generous, alright, let's get like 10 of those, or 9, so I'll have 10, well, a little bit more expensive. I was... Let's see, so that's for Pokemon Sleep. Get like nine of these, because why not? Oh, escape rope. What a odd item, and it's super expensive. I imagine that's for like... While you're in battle. Spray... Uh, I don't know about those. Used to escape instantly from a cave or a dungeon. Repel. Uh, an item that prevents any low level Pokemon from jumping at you for a while. Hmm. Uh, this item would be more way, way more useful in that Digimon game that I'm comparing this to, which is Digimon World Dawn, by the way. So. My breakdown so far, by the way, is that uh, this game starts off a little bit more so. So I'm going to buy like five of each of these. I don't think I'll need as many right now. Whoops. But um, my breakdown is that Digimon World Dawn, I'll talk about this game for that game first, is that it had a pretty interest, a way more interesting opening and its main hub area was a little bit confusing to work with at first, but it gets a little bit, you get used to it after a bit, even though I still would would have liked to map anyways. But battle system is a little bit simplistic and has been uh, better implemented in later games like Digimon Cyber Sleuth, for example. Uh, just more fluid, just more quicker, uh, looks better visually. Um, and such. And the quest thing, I like there, uh, I don't like how you're only accepting one quest at a time, but that's not that, that bad. Is it? Like, it's just like a meh thing. Alright, I might as well vent the plot, I guess. Alright, let's go over here. Here we are. You see, the trainer's school is... It's a... what in the world? Dum da dum dum. Is this the plot? Oh, it's that buffalo guy. I was wondering where he went off to. Alright, is this like my first boss character? Because I don't think I've faced a boss character in this yet. But um, yeah. Well, it looks like we won't be going that way anytime soon, thanks to Tauros there. But we were o only planning to go go as far as the trainer school anyway. We'll just leave that for some 
one else to deal with. Come uh, follow me. Oh, well, never mind. I guess not. <laughs> I was like, oh, I guess we're going uh, this way. I'm not going to bother reading that because I can't. It's too small. So, in comparison, Pokemon Sun. Oh, I thought, I okay, I'll stay here for a bit before I enter the plot zone up there. But, um, this game started a bit more slow. Uh, but I think it's starting to pick up a little bit now. But it, I don't think it's qu quite going to reach the level of, like, what you would normally see in a Digimon game. Um, I think the battle system is a bit smoother, the back and forth, uh, definitely reminds me of Digimon World 3, a game that I'll be playing later on. Uh, the look of the game is, uh, definitely improved from the other game that I am playing, which is Pokemon Mystery Dungeon, which has that very back and forth sort of style. And I think... I don't know if there's like a Pokemon Mystery Dungeon that came out later that's like, that looks like this. But I would like to see that though, if there is. Anyway. I think the story's slowly uh, catching up. And I do like the, the, the progression of like, the town at least. I think it's a little bit better than um, Digimon in the sense of you actually know where you're looking. Hey there, Zeke. I must have seen you too somehow, yeah? But welcome to the trainer school, the place you to learn to be a Pokemon trainer. You dig? Well, wow, looks like a really lonely place. That one kid just staring at a fence. He's training. Professor Kyuko, is this the child you told me about? Yeah, put him through the ringer, Teach. Four trainers. You've got to beat the four Pokemon trainers here at the, z the school, Zeke. The experience will surely help you and your team Pokemon get stronger, yeah? Actually, speaking of experience, why don't you take this? XP share. Okay. Inside. If you keep the XP share on, yeah, all the Pokemon in your team can get XP points from battle. The trainers who will take part in the lesson, in this lesson, may be inside the school. You may also want to visit our classrooms. Also, you'll you'll be sure to learn a lot. All right, let the lesson begin. She might not look at look all that tough, but that teach trains her kids right. One of her students is even a captain. If you want a big advice from me, a bit advice from me, here's something that might help. Once you've fought a species of Pokemon once, you can easily see what types of moves will work best on, the, on it in your next battle. Wandering about in a tall grass to meet lots of different Pokemon will help that what help Pokemon will help you with the help with that battle all the time, yeah? Oh, yeah. I felt a woo coming out. Alright. So, this is gonna be a weird recording day. Because I'm gonna save it, and then there's gonna be a cut. And I might come back to this another day. So, expect a cut here, I guess. Bye for now. And we're back after two days, believe it or not, of me watching two other movie reviews. 
uh, doing two movie reviews and then finishing off with a, a third movie later on today. I talked about it briefly how I think it was in one of my other videos I didn't mention Logan, but I will be seeing that right after this video. So, do you have anything else off of? You can tell me any. You can tell me any time that you want your team's health restored, and I'll help you. Seeing a Pokemon in pain makes my own heart ache. Blah. So, I think I was supposed to go up this way. <clears throat> All right, let's see what's going on up here. All right. Is that a gray meowth? Me. What Pokemon is that? It looks slightly different, but it looks like a recolor. Whoops. Ugh. So what's going on in here? Meowth, use fake out, make your opponent flinch. Oh, it is a meowth. Okay. Okay. Uh, the trainers who will take part in the lesson may be inside of our class. You may also want to visit our classrooms. Be you'll be learn. You'll be sure to learn a lot. Uh huh. Man, this layout kind of reminds me of um Persona, except smaller, slightly. I think. Uh, dum da dum da dum. Oh, I cannot go up this way. All right, I guess I'll go this way. Where's the progress? Oh, boy, you're awful close. Stand so close, and I want to battle you. Is that what you want, huh? Is it? Little, then I'll show you how I like to fight up close and personal. Okay, you do that. <laughs> mm hmm. Little girl, preschooler Mia. Oh man, Mia. Reminds me of uh, Resident Evil. She's gotta, she's gotta uh, possess me. She's uh, gotta have her daughter be like, yeah. Is that a tree lake Pokemon? Is that what I'm looking at here? Bonsley. Alright, let's see how effective a fire is on you. Should be super good. But pom. Alright. Oh, not very effective. Oh, interesting. But it was burned. What's that? What's going on over here? What what, what you what you working with? I'm confused. You're using fire? Shouldn't that heal me? <laughs> it's not very effective. Uh huh. Hurt by the burn. All right, let's try a physical attack, I guess. Uh huh. Yeah. Oh, this is going to be a very long battle. It's not very effective. Jeez, it's windy today. <laughs> I'm looking up and I'm looking outside. It's like, Jeebus. Oh, man. That's intense. Oh, it didn't even get to move. Uh... Hmm, I don't know which move is more f effective. 
What does Lick do anyway? I don't know. I have it on there. I, don't, I really don't want to waste a turn either just to find out what it does. Used Flail. Ow. Okay. A slightly longer battle. Little girl's got chops. Little girl's got chops. Uh, you know, it reminds me of um, the fi uh, something about Final Fantasy. I think uh, you know what? I'll 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 spend a move. I'll lick it out. Lickety lick lick. All right. Let's see what that does. Anyway. Oh. <laughs> That's nasty. So it is an attack. That's good. That's good. Also creepy, but good. So Lit has a super long tongue. Ooh. That's uh, it's gonna it's gonna prove useful for that ship of Black Ottoman. Just use that really big tongue. Ooh. Yum. Mmm. Yum, yum, yum. Yeah, you got top. The rest of your team gained EXP. Dem nut screwed to level 3. Oh, he, even though it didn't, you, it didn't even get to uh, level 4. He's not even up in my party and he got EXP. I uh, won't be as close to my Bonsley. You received 84 Poke. Wow, she's uh, she's celebrating her loss really well. Uh, your style of battle, it's pretty great, you know. Okay. Anything else in here? Let's check out this path. A split in the path. Oh boy, there's a lot going on in this school. Look at these babies, little, little little baby children. You got nothing to say? What if I go over here? We occasionally ask Professor Cuckoo to run a special class for our school. He's done a great deal of research into Pokemon moves after all. So your school teaches about Pokemon too? Where, where, where are all the other subjects? You don't teach English, you don't teach math, you don't teach science, you don't teach history. Probably, you probably actually do teach history. It's probably just the history of Pokemon. Look at your Pokemon. Whether it has any, has any claws or not, it would probably get a kick out of this one. Quick Claw. What does that even mean? Oh, it's an item. In Pokemon battles, the Pokemon with the highest speed that gets to act first. But with the Quick Claw, your Pokemon should be able to attack first regardless of its speed. Okay, or sometimes anyway, it's better than nothing. Right on. What about you? Can I even talk to you? You look like you're out of, you're out of bounds. What if I go this way? Some items don't do anything unless you give the Pokemon to hold. Oh, so, okay. I see. Uh, there are all those kids. I wonder if they have anything to offer. Let's see. Pokemon moves PP. Yep, I know about that. Won't be used anymore. Not to get restored. I mean, and you can take the Pokemon Center. So this is just more advice. Who... Do you think picks up all the Pokeballs you throw that don't catch any Pokemon? What a mystery. Getting petting Pokemon makes them happy. Oh, alright. And you? I can read. Here, watch. Move, moves have types just like Pokemon. If you use a move that is the same type as your Pokemon, it will get a special boost in power. Okay. I think that is everyone in the school area. What about over here? Is that just an exit? Yep. Alright. Well, 
this was going to be compiled with my other videos, so I'm actually going to save it here. Bloop. I'll probably train off camera a little bit, maybe, I don't know. But uh, anyways, I'll call it here for this one. And with that being said, I'm Thomas Lasuli Jr., a.k.a. Mustache Tom, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!